Uh, hi all and uh, welcome back to my channel. My name is Bog. Uh, today's video is going to be about some matchbox or oh, moving parts that I found just recently at my Walmart which really confused me that they actually had them and it's the Walmart closest to me which hardly has anything and I think is still working on some ancient dump bins that haven't been touched in forever because the models are all destroyed or at least the cards are. Uh, so we'll start with the first one which is a uh, 2000 uh, Nissan let's see if I get nope that's as far as I can go back uh, the moving part Nissan Xterra in this nice black uh, they're all 2020 releases so that's uh, <clears throat> and I'm gonna do like everybody else and just complete an utterly gripe about this packaging this packaging is the most stupidest packaging I've ever seen in my life can't stack they 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 hang on the the pegs really bizarrely i don't know what they're thinking with this packaging and i wish they would stop it but this is the first one and the opening feature on this is the back section which is plastic i think yes it is plastic and just kind of painted but not overly well but it is very nicely done uh, plastic uh, base metal body the top part is plastic also but it's, it's a sharp casting so tampoed front uh, non tampoed rear strange but oh well but it is a very nice uh, casting nice little running board detail on it and it is uh, quite a large model so doesn't they don't give you the scales on these anymore so but that is the one <clears throat> the next one is a 63 Chevy uh, C10 pickup in this nice little green with I guess a sports side box or whatever they call it so let's take a look at this one if I can get into it okay there we go and the nice little f feature is the hood which closes and opens quite nicely uh, the engine bay is all cream along with the interior and the box so you could see it's one big solid plastic piece along with uh, the base which is kind of a cream plastic but the truck itself is actually a very nice uh, very nice representation they did it quite quite nicely so that's pretty pretty cool and it looks really uh, a really sharp casting the next one is the 62 Willys Jeep wagon in this nice cream I have a green version of the old uh, super fast line I think it is with the box but never hurts to add another one to the collection so this one here is the opening features are the doors that close fairly well all the way around nice white rims so that's so it's a really really uh, a nice nice uh, representation they do have uh, tampo de uh, details in the rear lights uh, front lights little accent here on the top of the grill uh, the chrome bumpers are part of the base but it is uh, very nicely uh, very nicely done so I do like this one so that one's pretty cool uh, well, the next one we'll go with uh, 88 Chevy uh, Monte Carlo in this nice black uh, LS. <clears throat> Pop this puppy open. <clears throat> and they look like they've done some really nice features on that one. 
<clears throat> the opening features on those are the doors on both sides and they open uh, quite wide and large not on big dog leg hinges so it looks like little spring hinges uh, like you'd see on a lot of the higher end ones it goes up really nice nice rims uh, rear detail is really nicely done along with the front is nicely uh, tampered in uh, or painted grill <clears throat> nice uh, uh, five spoke rims really sharp I do like this one quite a lot they did a really nice job on that one and the last one in the series that I've got is this uh, 18 Land Rover uh, Vogue SE in this nice white color and I guess it's opening uh, feature is the rear hatch area so you could see that first close that up put a nice uh, nice rims on it nice detail painted detail on the lights and in the grill very nice uh, detail in on the side a little bit of paint wear or in badly applied looks like it's supposed to be little side vents or something but this is uh, it's it's a very nice uh, model so it'll go good with the other one I have so that's pretty cool so anyways uh, that's the uh, five uh, moving parts that I was able to find uh, so far I want to thank everybody for watching and if you like this kind of content please like share a comment and subscribe for more and I'll see everybody in the next video